Hi, I'm Sarah. Welcome to Toy Candy, your designer toy fix. Today, I'm unboxing Pop Mart's latest collaboration set with Mamiji for Christmas 2020. Who's excited? I am. Christmas is coming, kind of. I feel like it's a bit early to have the tree up, but this is such a Christmassy video that um, I thought, why not? Um, I've got a couple of Mamiji's most recent releases out here for us to see. So I've got Winter Wonderland 20 over there. And this side, I've got uh, Snowfy, who's literally just arrived today as I'm about to record this. Both sold out super quick. Mamiji are on fire um, this Christmas with their releases. And uh, this was no exception. This absolutely flew out of stock on Mamiji's website site still available with pop mart and possibly from other resellers um you might have to be pretty quick to get hold of these because i think they are limited so um i've spoken before about um pop mart and mamiji so they've been collaborating uh, recently the last uh, year or so last year was the first set that came out where uh, mamiji uh, designed some blind box figures for pop mart um, there's been uh, another set since which came out around spring and now we've got this beautiful 12 piece um, Mamiji Christmas set. So there's actually 13 characters in the set, as with all Pop Mart sets. Uh, we can see them all on the bottom here. Um, there's 12 standard figures and a chaser figure who is a beautiful little angel called Angelica. So our chances of unboxing Angelica today are extremely low. Um, there is only one Angelica in every 12 of these cases. So one in 144 blind boxes. I have my little permission to dream Mamiji pin on um, ready to go in the hope that maybe we can pull this secret. I don't know how much I fancy my chances, but if I get a hold of her, that will be incredibly exciting. But even if I don't, this is an absolutely gorgeous set and I'm so excited to see them all in real life. So let's go. I've got my little pink knife and I'm going in. So uh, I've got cling film tightly wrapped over this. Uh, we can see we've got, um, there's always one main character on the front. So that's Ruthie, who is a little reindeer. So uh, hopefully we'll be seeing her shortly. Um, well, we will be seeing her shortly if we get the standard set. So I'm going in at the side here to just take my cling film off. I am so excited about this. I did not expect to get these so quickly. Um, I thought Pop Mart would probably release them first and Mamiji would follow. Um, but they're here and they're ready and I'm so excited. The box is absolutely gorgeous. We've got a little Christmas village um, and we've got some little music notes and oh, it just couldn't be more Christmassy, could it really? And little castles and little stars and little houses. Absolutely love the box. It's beautiful. Um, so let's go in. I'm going to open it. Oh, I've got another thing to cut. I've got to cut the little tabby there and try not to rip the box as I open it. I really don't want to damage the box. I'm in. Wow. Okay. So look at this. Look at these blind boxes. I'm just going to fold this away. So this is just such cute detail. So all of my little blind boxes inside, as you see, I've got 12 inside ready to open and they're all little Christmas presents. So these little ribbons are absolutely adorable. Little pink ribbons. Uh, let's take out the first box and have a little closer up look at it. So we'll move those to one side for now. Okay. So here is our first blind box. Uh, so you can see it's got Ruthie on the front, all of the other um, characters on the side um, and the little bow on the top, which um, carries on round the sides. So we've got it like down the sides here as well, just like a little gift. And we've got 12 of these to open. I'm so excited. I can't wait. So let's get stuck in. So go and get my knife. I'm going to open these from the bottom just to try and preserve them a little bit. Um, now, what should we do? So in these blind boxes, unlike ones that I've unboxed previously, we're going to get a little card to tell us uh, which character is in the packet inside. So we can either look at the card, first of all, or we can just open, we can not look at the card, and we can open the bag and we can get a surprise. I think what I'll do first is I'll um, show you a card. Okay. So... This one is going to be Santa. So I'll show you the little card here. So there's a little picture of Santa. So yeah, basically inside the inside the box, you get this little card and you get the blind bag like this. Um, and then a little separate bag at the bottom for any accessories. I think in the past, these little accessories have been stuck to the side of the foil like this. Um, but it's come 
separately this time. So, um, yeah, as I say, you can kind of try not to look at the card and just go straight for the bag. Um, so this one says, so Mamiji always um, have two things that they like. So this one says, I like botany and bagels. And it's got a little Christmas message which says, tonight is my big night, sleep tight. Um, so I suppose it is because she's Santa. So let's have a look at the doll. Lots of crackling. Let's get her open. Here she is. Oh my gosh. I just love the vinyl dolls. I always know they're going to be gorgeous, but they're always even better in real life when I see them. Just so, so cute. So here she is. So she's got her little accessory, which is a little letter with a little smiley face. So that will go in her hand. I will, um, I won't put all the accessories together with them just to save time. I'll show you them all um, completely built at the end. So this is Santa. She's got her red hair, her little hat um, and her little trim around her dress and sort of a darker, darker red hair than um, her outfit. And um, she is so cute in little boots. So um, the vinyl versions of these dolls don't have the little message slits. Um, the, re the resin Mamiji dolls always have a little um, place to put a little message slip in there. But the vinyl ones don't have that, I think, just because they're a little bit small. Um, but she is beautiful. So let's open another one. Right, let's see who we've got next. So another blind box, all the all the outsides look exactly the same because the idea is if you buy these individually, you won't know who you're going to get. Um, it's really hard to do this without breaking them because of the globe. And I don't want to, I'm a little bit precious about boxes. I like them to stay as intact as I can possibly do. Okay, no, this one's just going to have to get a little bit destroyed. Sorry. Right, okay. Right, this time I'm not going to look at the card. Let's get a surprise is the bag. I'm not looking at the card, which is rattling around in there. Okay. Let's see who we get. Oh, this one's actually open. It's meant to be kind of have to tear at the top, but let's have a look. We have got... Ah! Oh, this is one of the little elf pair. I think this is nice. Let's have a look. So there's two elves in this set, naughty and nice. And let's see. Yeah, here's a little card. And uh, she comes with a little nice sign, uh, which I will attach to her later. She is so cute. She's got little elf-shaped elf ears and everything. And she's got little star cheeks. Do you know what? I Not that I didn't expect any of these to be weak because they're all so gorgeous, but I thought that the elves wouldn't be up there with my favourites. I mean, I haven't opened the others yet, but this is really actually exceeded my expectations this is really really cute um they brought out an elf doll last year called elfie um and this is adorable um she kind of would go so well with that with that with that doll um and the little i assume her little friend uh, naughty would as well that is adorable so um, i'm gonna put her over here uh, what i should have done is put santa over there with her so i'll fix that now and we will open another Next, let's see who we've got. So I've put Santa. I've put Santa there now, so that I'll put them. Put them on. Might as well put them on the desk as we as we go along, so we can see the whole collection together. Uh, right. So going in, I quite like doing the doing the not looking at the card. I think that's the way I'm going to do this. So it's really hard not to look, though. You know, really difficult. Right. So let's see who we got. Da -da. So remember, we've got a one in. One in 12 chance, I guess, of getting um, Angelica, the angel, in this set. It's very hard not to hope the whole time you're opening, but I mean, I don't want to get too disappointed if she's not there because it's still a gorgeous set. This is Frostina, the snowman, which is super cute, cool. Look at his little glasses, her little glasses, I should say, Frostina. Um, so she's kind of a snowman in her own right, but then her head kind of turns into a further snowman, which I really think is cute. Um, she's got little matching gloves to the little snowman scarf and little heart cheeks. I love heart cheeks on these dolls and a little top hat. And she, um, if we get Snowfy, so let's compare to uh, Mamiji's cr Christmas release this year. Don't they look so cute together? Love that. Absolutely loving that. Their colours like go really beautifully together as well. Uh, put Snowfy back. So just to not confuse things, she's not in this set. Um, so yeah, this is Frostina. Let's see what Frostina likes. I forgot to look at um, Nice's little card. Okay. Frostina likes lorgnettes and licorice. I don't know what a lorgnette is. See, Mamiji's educational as well as cute. Um, I'm such a snappy dresser. Won't you keep me company? <laughs> I like the little messages that come with them. That's really sweet. Um, so yeah, there we go. There we have Frostina. 
I've just gone back and got um, Nice's card to share with you. So Nice likes sunrises and snowballs. I'm on my best behaviour. Want to be on my list? I do, because that's the list that, you know, Santa brings more presents to. So, yes, very sweet. Okay, let's put that back down there. Right, next one up. Let's take one out. So um, there's like a perforated side down this lid as well so that you can kind of stand this up. Like if it was in a store or something, you could kind of have this like that. Um, anyway, yeah. So number four, we've still got, what's that? Can't do maths. Um, nine to go. Um, yes, nine to go. <laughs> right, let's go in. Uh, let's see. Let's do another, not look at the card. Don't look at the card. Little bag. Right, let's see who we've got. And we've got Svana. Svana is a little swan, um, which is like not something you typically necessarily get in a Christmas set. So I kind of like that they've gone a little bit of a different way with this. And look how pretty she is. She's got a little starry dress. Um, really like that little swan. It's kind of, kind of like a visor kind of cap, which is really cute. And she is really, really adorable. I really like the colours on her. She's very, she's very me coloured. Um, in terms of her little outfit. That's the kind of colours I like to collect. Um, so I'll put her there. So let's see what Svana's little card says. It says she likes Christmas movies and yoga. Uh, yoga, because she, st she can stretch like a swan. I like it. Spread your wings and feel the winter magic. Beautiful. So cute. Loving her. She's a bit of a different one. Great. Let's see who we've got next. Right. Let's see who's next. Um, let's cut the box open. Try and get in there without doing too much damage. I'm saying that every time, but it's really an effort. <laughs> I mean, it's fair enough. I suppose they the, they don't want people to go resealing these and, uh, you know, selling them on. Okay, this time let's look at the card instead of opening the bag first. Who's it going to be? It's going to be Teresa. Teresa is little Christmas tree who we will open in a second. She likes drumming and dumplings. Lots of alliteration going on in these likes, which is cute. Um, gather round all you good boys and girls. I'm the heart of our home. Which she is because she's a Christmas tree. Right, let's get Teresa open. This one's been really popular. I think a lot of people really love this one. I don't know. On first glance, um, other than the secret... I knew the secret was going to be an angel and I knew I was going to just love her and she is just the cutest. Um, I think my favourite from looking at the box is uh, Ginger. So I'm looking forward to opening Ginger. Um, here is Teresa. She is really sweet. Um, she's the first one that I actually saw of this set. Um, came up on Potmart's uh, Instagram feed the other day. Um, so she's got a little Christmas tree hat. And I like also how her dress is kind of tiered as well, like a Christmas tree. And her dark green hair and her little little bow tie and a little star at the top that is really really sweet um so that's Teresa. um let's have a look at what we've got we're nearly halfway let's see who's next okay next up open 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 oh i completely messed that one up right let's just tear this one across the bottom and be done with it right i'm gonna go back to looking at the like not looking at the card i'm gonna open the bag it's just more exciting that way you get more of a surprise all right let's see who it is who do you reckon who do you reckon it's going to be you've seen this set before who are you hoping to see next and it is <gasps> this is belinda belinda's so cute a little fox little fox i love animal mimiji so much they're like some of my favorites i love so everything about this. She comes with a little bell. It's a little accessory, which I will attach uh, for the end of the video. She's got a big bushy tail and she's just like basically in a fox onesie, which is just adorable. And I love the colour of her hair. I like the colours. I think they really complement each other nicely. And I like her little kind of joyful little closed eye expression. She's adorable. I really like her. She reminds me a bit of uh, one of the Winter Wonderland designs previously that had like a little foxy hat as well. Um, so yeah, there's Belinda. Oh, need to read you the card. Belinda, the fox, likes card games and couture and says, shh, I know Christmas secrets. What are your Christmas secrets? Where's the secret chase? Tell me where she is. Right. Uh, <laughs> I need to not pin all my hopes on this chase. It's so unlikely. 
cool. Right, so that's Belinda. And we will, we are halfway now. That's six open, six to go. So who are we going to have next? Let's look. So we've still got to open. We've got the other elf, which is called Naughty. We've uh, got Dolce or Dulce, who is Little Nutcracker with a with a very toy candy uh, little lollipop. Uh, we've got Maggie, who's a penguin. Uh, we've got Puds, who's a little uh, Christmas pudding, and we've got Ginger, um, my probably my favourite, the little gingerbread house. Can't wait to see her. So who's this going to be next? Problem is, if I don't look at the card first, I'll nearly forget to like read you the card. Gonna do it my way anyway. Gonna open the bag and get a surprise. It is. I'm not even gonna look this time. It is. I did look. <laughs> Ruthie. Oh yeah, Ruthie, of course. I forgot Ruthie. She's on the front of the box. Uh, Ruthie is like a little Rudolph reindeer. Look how cute she is. I love the little um, holly on her little um, on her little horns and her red nose, of course. And she's playing an accordion because why not? Um, I like that. I like the I like the colours on this, and I like the pattern. That's really cute. And look at her cool, like swept hair. It's like goes to a point. It's like very sweepy. I really like her. She's really cute. I think she's another one that um, has been really popular with people. I'm gonna put her there in the middle of those guys, and um, move on with another. Ah, I forgot to do the card. See, this is the problem. I'm going to read you the card. I like roses and rice cakes. The adventure begins. I will light your way. Ah, oh, with her red nose. Like that. That's Ruthie. Next up. Okay. Oh, it's getting intense. These are so great in real life. They're even better than they looked when I saw photos of them. Uh, let's do a card first this time, shall we? Let's see who we've got. We have got... We've got Naughty. So Naughty is uh, the little friend for Nice. So let's get her back. She hasn't got a little sign yet because I haven't um, given them the accessories yet. So she likes sunsets and slippers. I'm on the Naughty list. It's much more fun. <laughs> I like that. She's cheeky. So this one is um, basically very similar to Nice, but she's a different colorway. And she's got a few different details. She's got a little tongue sticking out. She's so cute. And she's got little heart cheeks instead of stars. So um, these guys go together. There they are. Um, and you'll see them a lot better when I uh, put their little accessories with them. But I think they're really cute. So also, if you put them... Actually, no, either way. So which which side does their sign... Their signs go that way. So if you put them that way, they can hold hands, which is adorable. I love it. So that's naughty and nice. Two thirds of the way in, four to go. Who are we going to have next? Let's see. How am I getting worse at this? I swear I'm getting worse at opening these the more I do. Let's just cut. Let's just cut the box. <laughs> getting more and more destructive with everyone. Okay, I'm going to go back to the bag first. Not looking, not looking, not looking. Come on, think angel. Think angel. Puds. It's Puds. So she's got a little uh, gingerbread man accessory, which is in there somewhere, who, which is really cute. So this this doll is kind of quite um, similar to a Christmas release that Mamiji did in 2016 called Scrumptious. Um, she reminds me of her. So she's like a cute little sister for Scrumptious. Um, she says, I like house music and sketching full of love. I like house music and sketching full of love. She's full of love. Um, I could burst with deliciousness. And she could. Look, she's so cute. She's another one who's got a little like little tongue out expression, which is really sweet. Um, and she's got little pigtails and a little skirt. I like the colours of her skirt. It's very candy coloured. Really cute. Let's put her there. Good stuff. So that's uh, Puds. Next up. Oh, I've just seen the card. I've just seen the card. I didn't mean to look, but I did. I saw the end, the end of it. It's my personal little fave, Ginger. Ah, she's a little gingerbread house. Dun, 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 dun. And she says, I like knitting and naps. Um, and then she says, sugar and spice and all things nice. It's her little, uh, little uh, quote thing. So let's open her up. <gasps> really excited to see this one. The detail on this one is amazing. Also like Teresa, look, look how much like tiny detail she has, little 
hearts and stars on top. <gasps> She's amazing. She's amazing. Okay, look at her little peace sign. I love the little peace sign. Look at the look at the detail on this. Okay, so she's got this roof which is all iced, iced roof with a little chimney, and she's got little candies all over her. So she's perfect for toy candy and little kind of snowflakes. And I love everything about this. So this is why this is like one of the reasons that I really love the vinyls because the uh, the resin they just can't really do this kind of detail without making it super breakable or um, it taking loads and loads of time to, for them to hand paint and do well so this is one of the benefits of uh of vinyl i love her she's my favorite so far definitely and we've got two left two left to go who's it gonna be right who do we have left we've got maggie the penguin we haven't had her yet and we haven't had dolce who is the little nutcracker and we haven't had the angel, but we're probably not going to get Angelica, sadly. Let's see. Uh, right. Who's it going to be? I'm not going to look at the card. I nearly did. I nearly did. Oh, well, I've got this little toy candy lollipop, so I know that it's Dolce because <laughs> um, that came out with her. So let's just read the card while we're here. This is probably another one of my favourites from this set. I think she's really, really cute. Um... There she is, Dolce. It says, I like tidiness and tap dancing. Let me tell you a story. It began long, long ago. Um, so this is probably my like other favourite of this set. Let's have a look at that in real life. Got a Nutcracker set already that Mamiji brought out um, for Christmas last year. But look at the pink. Look at all the pinkness and the purpleness. Um, and yeah, she obviously holds her little, uh, her little lollipop. I love her. She's amazing. That's Dolce. I'm going to put her here next to Ginger. Um, they're my favourite two so far. I mean, not that I don't love all the others because I do, um, but they're looking amazing. Okay, we've got one left to go, just one. So it's probably Maggie the Penguin, but there's a very small chance it could be um, Angelica the Angel. Right, last one. Let's have a look. Let's get it open. Oh, that might be the best opening I've done. Right, we're going for the bag. First of all, who is it? Let's see. It's Maggie, the penguin. I don't want to sound disappointed. I am a little bit disappointed because I would have loved to have uh, pulled the chase for you during this video. But um, let's have a look at Maggie. So she likes, what does she like? She's got a candy cane, which I will attach. I like ice cream sandwiches and jazz. Are you ready to play? I know the way. And uh, she is so cool. Look at look at her penguin head. I love it. And I love her scarf. Like this has got some really nice like movement in the scarf, which is really nice. Like she's a little bit windswept and she's got star cheeks. I love this little heart and star cheeks business. Um, so that's Maggie. And there's the full set minus the chase, which we didn't get, but that's okay. Um, we'll find her eventually. I will get hold of one. Check out my Instagram. I will get hold of um, an Angelica somewhere at some point. But there they all are. Um, so let's have a closer look at them um, and see them in all their glory. There we have it. There is the beautiful Christmas 2020 Potmart and Mamiji collaboration blind box set. They are absolutely stunning. If you can get your hands on these and you're even thinking about getting them, do it. <laughs> it's all I can say. They're amazing. Um, but you might have a bit of trouble getting hold of them from Mamiji. I'm not sure if they're getting any more. Um, definitely not before Christmas from what I read. Um, but you might be able to get some um, after Christmas, whether people want them after Christmas, I don't know. But um, yeah, just to say thank you so much for watching. Um, if you would like to see more Pop Mart unboxing videos, more Mamiji videos, please let me know what you want to see. I'm always happy to hear from you. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave me a comment about who your favourite Christmas Mamiji is. Um, and I'll see you next time. Thanks so much.